Hey, how's it going? It's Zing, and today I want to go over the average Joe experience of playing this game right now. What day is it? March 7th? <laughs> yeah, so I really just want to go over like the average experience. I play with a lot of average players. I would say I'm pretty good at this game, but I play with people who are a lot newer to the game, and I'm I'm getting getting off this game after 30 minutes every night because of uh, how things usually go and i want to talk about that i want to talk about changes i hope a dev sees this because i think i can i think i have pretty good ideas i think maybe that's just me in my head but i think i have some good ideas we can do to fix how people will get matched together and stuff like that anyways i'm going to timestamp the bottom of this video and so i'm going to highlight some of the points on uh, what what i want to talk about and in the meantime, watch the background video. It's the re the end of it is the reason I made this video, and why I think this video is very, very, very needed. Um, yeah. So it's really just a big snowball. So definitely watch that. Anyways, we need to fix the ranking system because I'm not a big streamer. I'm not a big YouTuber, right? I'm the average Joe player. Who he plays with average guys, and I don't have forty five thousand to spend on a kit. Don't have a bunch of named items sitting in my stash. I don't have full gold sitting around, you know. And I think a lot of people are right there with me. And we can't play the game right now. We cannot play the game because, and I'm pretty sure in every single lobby, there's at least, at least one just over the top geared guys who just like, make no sense of being in that lobby. It's just, it's crazy. I mean, I get into a game with full gold barbarians and full gold clerics and rangers and shit. Like, I can't do anything against that. I I really just can't. Me and my team just can't. It's crazy. And I'm what I'm thinking to fix that is having a gear score. And hear me out. How it would work is based off the rarity of the gear starting at gray all the way up to uniques and named they all have a number score based off the color and then based on every single role it has if that role so you see the pants on the screen <laughs> three hp those can roll six hp so if it's below half it would add to the gear score i mean no it would not add to the gear score but if it's above half of what number it could roll it would add to the gear score and the game would be able to judge where it needs to place you. And everyone will be placed in the same gear score um, group instead of rank. Rank should just be AP, you know. People want to AP farm, let them AP farm. They don't want to PvP, don't let them PvP, you know, whatever. The people who really want to gear up and fight, they need to, um, they need to have a gear score. This full gold barbarian, I mean, cleric that I just, or fighter that I just killed. Um, I actually don't know how I killed them. That was crazy. I think it, my my build's just very good compared to melee guys. Anyways, check that video out. It's in the top right right now. And, um, anyways, gear score, it needs to be like that, honestly. Because that would put it, that would put people in full gold with people with full gold. And if they have full gold but very bad rolls, like, you know, every roll is dog shit. Obviously, roles like ma magical interactions shouldn't count towards gear score, physical, in or yeah, physical interaction or whatever. All that shouldn't count. Only the things that would impact PvP would count as something that affects gear score. So if the fizz power on a chest piece can roll five percent, if it rolls two point four, it would not make your gear score higher. If it rolls two point six or two point five, it would increase your gear score. And so this and this way it would like the game would know how powerful you are, not just based on not just based on um the rarity, but also the rolls. Because obviously like you can have a blue with good rolls and it's better than a purple. I mean that's just everyone knows that. And um Yeah, I just don't like I don't like the fact that I'm going in like, what I have now, like, on the screen right here, this cleric kit, it's fast, but it's really weak. It has no HP. Only thing it has is being fast. 
and I'm basically like very ungeared. My teammate has like nothing. He's literally like a naked bard. And we should not have been matched with these gold guys. It's nice to gear up instantly like that. But the chance that like the fact that we actually won that fight was like way, way less odds than just dying to this these guys if they were any better at the game. These guys kinda sucked, honestly. Sorry to these guys. Anyways, we should not have been matched with them. Simple. We should be able to slowly work our way up. The more gear, the better gear we get, the higher gear lobbies we get. If we have low gear, you get low gear lobbies. If you're in a full gray kit, you're going to get people in full gray kits. I mean, that's how it should be. Because that makes the game more skill-based. I mean, this game is not skill-based right now as much as it is like stat-checking people. I get stat checked 30 times a fucking day. And it is terrible. It is so bad. I see a piece of gold on them and half the time I just fucking run. Because I know they're going to stat, stat check my ass. I'm naked. I'm trying to get a good start to the day. I'm trying to snowball a little bit. And it's just not it's not working. Because uh, every time I get a good snowball, something goes terribly wrong in the gear difference. Like, I just sit there and question, like, why the fuck am I in this guy's game? Why did this guy kill me? Why did I die to him? Hmm? Why did I die to him? He is fucking... If he had a fucking gear score, it would be, like, over 9,000 more than mine. It's just, like, it's wild. They need to fix that. I think that... I think that was, like... A, I think that's a good solution, honestly. The color of the gear with the rolls... If the rules are more than half of the number that they can roll, adds to the gear score. It's very simple. I mean, obviously I'm not no game designer, but I think that would be the best way of ranking people in lobbies. So, hopefully a dev sees this and watches this. Yeah, I really want that. That would be nice. If they made that change, I'd actually play this game so much more. Because I want a snowball. I mean... I don't know. I'm not, like I said, I'm not this big streamer who can just go in and play with a really, really good team and, you know, like running BIS, running gold all the time. I, no, I, I work my way up for like from the very, very bottom to the top. And I think that would get, make the game so much enjoyable, more enjoyable. Like, these full gold teams can't just come by and run you over when you're halfway through your snowball like your mid mid kit versus their biscuit i mean it's really just like a it really just ruins the day seriously and so that's like the main thing i wanted to talk about on this video um yeah i mean i think that's, that was my main point in this entire video so let me see on what else I wrote down to talk about. Um, not much actually. That gear system thing, gear score gear system thing is really the main thing. But like I said, this background video is the reason I made it. So watch this. And dead to the crossbow guy. Fucking get rid of this, please. <laughs> Anyways, so I have some good fights, right? You all saw the gold. I'm running the gold now. We fought a gold team. And killing this fighter right here feels really nice. But he didn't die. I thought he'd die in all the smoke right there. And I used PvE to block that guy. Hopefully he dies in there. He never actually died. Anyways. Cleric almost kills me here. Whatever. This game is insignificant to the snowball. Because I end up just grabbing Hazel's gear. After surging right here and we end up getting out uh i probably said that a little too early i'm trying to really make some time here um yeah the the timestamp is going to say just yapping <laughs> right here because that's all i'm fucking doing anyways okay we get out so this next game right oh these guys are like giga geared forgot to say that <laughs> we almost won too anyways this next game right here put on the gold 
I'm at 131 HP, whatever. This fight right here, this is why I made the video. This entire video, this entire video, everything I've talked about, it's all because of this fight. So, quick recap, we, we geared up, you know, we did it. We, we didn't get Bissington guys first game. Actually, no, we did, <laughs> but we, we killed one, right? We, we were lucky to kill one. Half the time, they turn around and stat check you anyways. But my perks allowed me to kind of say fuck you. Anyways, recap, we snowballed. We got some gold. We set it aside. We went back in basically naked. We tried getting gear. We tried building our way up. And we did a little bit. We bought some of our gear off the things we sold from this full legendary barbarian that we killed somewhere in the video. Um, yeah. Anyways, as you can see, that guy has a fucking echo of screams sitting on his back. Yeah. So, as you could probably tell, we're going to die. And we do. But the thing is, we play this so well, you know, like my ranger, he doesn't do that much damage. He could have probably been a little more geared, but uh, these guys were full gold. Like they're, they're just like Bissington. They have two named items. The other one has the uh, life after death. And it's like, how do we, why, no, why do we get in matches with these guys? If my ranger had any more gear, we might've had a chance. But he didn't, so we shouldn't even be in this lobby. Like, my gear's not, uh, like, my near, my gear's not nearly good enough to fight these guys. I mean, it's good to fight people my gear level, but not these guys. Two named weapons, really? And 60 Francesca axes. Please put a limit. We need a limit on Franny axes. Five stacks per game. If you miss 10 fucking Franny axes or don't get your team, your enemy low, you don't deserve to use Franny axes. Because no one wants 30 fucking Franny stone at them. It's terrible. Double Barb. They do more damage than my Ranger. Seriously. They're probably doing more damage than my Ranger to the body. They throw it quicker. And they could Achilles strike me. That's just wild. Anyways. Here's about when we die. Um, This is the whole reason I made the video. I'll show their gear at the end. And. I just. I really hope this kind of. I, I don't know if this will reach a lot of people. A lot of people don't like hearing me yap about things. But um, I really hope people understand where I'm coming from. When I say I just want to gear up normally, slowly, take it slow. But no, I died to this guy with fucking Neko screams and the other guy with life after death. My teammate's getting some good shots. And I, I did whiff, right? Like, we might have had a little higher of a chance if I didn't whiff so hard. But... Um, I, we really had no chance. I mean, it was just a matter of time before they Franny axed us down or something. So here's their gear. And I'll show you. Yeah, there we go. There's their gear, and we just shouldn't have been matched with them, really. And this is the average perspective, or this is like the average day. Honestly, this is a daily thing for me. And um, if this isn't a daily thing for everyone else... Maybe it's just me, maybe, right? Maybe I have bad luck. But every single day, how it goes, we snowball, nice. We snowball, nice. Second, third game. Third game, right? We have a little bit of gear, mid gear. We've killed a lot of people. Our gear level, maybe. Maybe even higher, right? Maybe we're just better than them, right? And then fourth game. Say third or fourth game, just full gold, you know? Bist wizards, bist out warlocks, unkillable warlocks. With, like, the damage that we have. Like, we don't... We literally just don't do enough damage to, like, kill a warlock. At all. Phantomize out. Whatever. And, um... I hope everyone enjoyed this video. It, it really was just a big rant. And... Please, um... Get this to a dev. Holy shit. Please. <laughs> Anyways. GG's. I will see you in the next one.